How's everybody doing today? We're going to do a quick tutorial on how to clear your Adobe caches on a Mac. Now, when you're using the Adobe Creative Cloud and any of the Adobe applications, they form these cache folders that end up taking quite a bit of space. These could be render files or other various files that are essentially used to speed up your work process, but after some time in a lot of projects, they take up quite a bit of hard drive space. So there's no harm in deleting these, and every once in a while, it's a good thing to clear up the space. So if you open up your Finder, and you go and quickly just see, on this desktop right here, I have about 250 gigs available. Well, let's dive in and see what we can do to clear up some space. So if you head up to your top, your menu up at your top of your screen here. So if you head up to the top menu and click on Go, you'll see a series of selections. If you hold down the Option key, a hidden library selection comes up. So click on that and it's gonna bring you to your library settings. Now these are folders that have essentially access to everything that's on your computer. Well, within this, there's a series of folders that will take us to these Adobe caches. So the first one is under application support, and then you wanna find Adobe, and then you wanna find common. In here is the media cache files folder, and this has a number of files. So if we just go in, and in this case, I have 11,000 plus files in this folder. Now remember, we're at 246 gigs available. If I go ahead and move this to trash, and you know what? You can actually delete this media cache folder as well. Move to trash. So we've got those two in the trash, and before we do the big delete, we're gonna also go to another folder where we can find some more cache files. So if you go all the way back to our library folder, you wanna look for caches. And under caches, you'll see Adobe. And then you'll have a number of different apps that you might use. Um, we'll just go in and do the After Effects cache here. And you'll see this 13.7, that's the version we're on. And you've got your disk cache, which you can just go ahead and highlight everything inside. Whoops. And you can just delete it all. And of course, there's the other applications within Adobe that you can check out to see if you have any cache files in. Um, right now, I don't with Premiere. But we did those three main files in that previous folder structure and in this Adobe folder structure here. So let's see, we have 246 gigs available. Let's go ahead and clear our trash bin. And you'll see it's just thousands of files. And now we're up to 282 gigs available on the hard drive. So that was a 35 gig clearance there that we just did just by clearing. It was a 35 gig clearance there just by deleting some of these cache files. And again, your Adobe apps will still run just fine. These are some render files and various files that sort of build up over time and, and collectively create a huge number of hard drive space that they're taking up. So I hope this helps. Feel free to leave comments if you have questions on the process here. Like the video, subscribe, and be sure to share with others. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a good one.